find uh, Kurdistan regional uh, president Masoud Barzani came out with a press conference a few hours ago and he said that the referendum will go ahead as planned after a meeting with the top three or the three major uh, Kurdistan or Kurdish parties uh, despite international pressure despite pressure and threat by the Iraqi central government and despite even regional threats we've seen that even until the last minute uh, Iran on one side as well as Turkey tried to pressure the, the Kurdistan uh, government to postpone the, uh, the referendum, but the, the Kurdistani president said no way. And I have to tell you that we've been here in Erbil for more than a day, and we are feeling that even the majority of the uh, Kurdish people that we've uh, come in touch with and we've spoken to are for uh, the referendum and are for the, uh, you know, for keeping the referendum uh, time and day on, which is uh, in less than 12 hours from now. So the referendum is going through despite international pressure and I have to tell you that there is a slight uh, disappointment from uh, by, you know, from the Kurdish uh, government and population of the Americans. One of the people that we uh, interviewed today was former French Foreign Minister Bernard Kushner who had a lot to say and he is part of the uh, observation uh, uh, committee that will be observing the referendum. Let's have a listen to what he had to say. Uh, tomorrow will uh, assist and participate, not me, I'm not a Kurdish guy, uh, to a referendum. And this is a, an historical event, an historical moment for the Kurdish people. They are looking for that since we, the French, the Brits and the others, at the end of the uh, Ottoman Empire, we promised to the Kurdish people to get a nation. And we were lying, and we, did, we, we, we were not fil fulfilling our promises. Now, Mohammed, Iraqi Prime Minister Haider al Abadi is also uh, expected to make an address later on. What can we expect to hear from him? Actually, Tracy, he did have a press conference right after Kurdistan President Masoud Barzani came out with his own uh, press conference and he continued uh, blaming and threatening the uh, Kurdistani government. He, in fact, told the Kurdish people that uh, we will stay a, a one Iraqi co uh, country, one Iraqi government. Nobody will uh, divide us. He said that this sectarian, uh, this sectarian uh, divide is coming from Erbil. It's not from Baghdad. And he asked the Kurdish people to ask their leaders, where is the money from? the oil revenue that the Kurdish government has been accusing Baghdad of not providing or giving uh, to the Kurdish people. So the accusation and war force is still ongoing between the Iraqi central government in Baghdad as well as the uh, Erbil or the Kurdistan uh, regional government here in Erbil. The referendum is still uh, uh, going tomorrow at 8 o'clock uh, Erbil time and uh, the, the war force not only here in Iraq and Kurdistan, even regionally, regionally is still ongoing.